Indigenous children in remote and very remote locations are being significantly outperformed by non-Indigenous students and students living in metro locations. One clear stat shows that between 40% and 60% of Indigenous children in very remote locations across Western Australia, South Australia and the Northern Territory are achieving below minimum standards in reading in Year 3. This is certainly something that we cannot ignore. Hi, I'm Dylan Anderson for the Project for Awesome here in the National Library of Australia. Right now, Indigenous students are five times more likely to fail the national minimum for standard or for reading and numeracy. That number increases for students out in regional areas. The Indigenous Literacy Foundation strives to close that gap. The Foundation has programs to tackle different areas of literacy like the Book Buzz program, which works with parents, families and organisations to introduce babies, toddlers and preschoolers to the joys of reading. They even translate the book so kids learn in language. And the Book Supply program asks organisations to rally their communities to send books to regional areas that don't have access to books. In addition to schools, libraries, playgroups, women's centres and youth drop-in centres in communities, the Foundation works with specific service organisations to deliver books. These organisations include Indigenous libraries and knowledge centres, health department and allied health workers from nurses to occupational therapists, the Rural Flying Doctor Service and Mission Australia. Community literacy projects focus on publishing books that are written or developed by community members. These books, which many have been written by children, recognise the importance of community stories, respond to the requests of community and have positive literacy outcomes. There are two distinct categories of books that the Foundation has been involved in publishing. This includes stories written by children and educational book resources written in consultation with community members. To date, they have published, in partnership, 37 books. You can help the Indigenous Literacy Foundation by voting this video in this year's Project for Awesome or heading to their website and setting up a small continuing donation. Your support can help children discover the wonderful world of reading. I'm Dylan Anderson for the Indigenous Literacy Foundation, DFTBA.